Came back from Ikea, I have a little haul. So, going for a clean white aesthetic. Got some new bed sheets. And then I have a suitcase. I'm gonna slowly start packing. I've been putting that off. I feel like if I start packing, then it's really gonna hit me. So I'm just postponing as long as possible. But this is a start. Once I have this in my room every day, I'm gonna be reminded I have to do a little bit by little bit so that I'm not like super stressed in the last week. Ah, oh, it's raining, shoot. Okay, so I'm gonna go for like a 15 minute run. Recently, I started running, which is really um, unusual because normally, I would like avoid running at all costs, but I found it to be kind of stress relieving, so trying something new. Good morning! It is so nice outside. Look at the sunlight. I do have allergies though, so take a Claritin, the fast dissolve. So I am in a fantastic mood. It's also my last official full day of classes. So later today, after my first class, I'm gonna have lunch with my friend Jerry. We actually met each other back in first year. How do you feel about last, last week of class? I feel great. I haven't been doing any studying, no school, not going to class, yep. can't wait. Yes, that is also me the past semester, so can't wait for that. <laughs> it's a viewing party! <laughs> oh, okay. Hello, who are we Hello. with? Hello, Reagan, Jesse, Jerry, main oh, character energy. <laughs> okay, what are you, you guys up to? Me, I just made a reservation for a friend's birthday. I'm doing absolutely nothing. We just watched Kat's recent vlog. We're big fans. <laughs> you know, we were the 700th, 800th subscriber. Yeah, Which remember to like, so subscribe, and comment. Wait, and turn on the notification bells. Yeah. Congrats on 800 subscriber milestone. That's right. <laughs> so for dinner, I am actually having a salad that I got free from school. Um, we have this club called Hiwi, stands for health and wellness, and they were handing out free lunches today. Also, I like realized <laughs> I actually have classes next week. I kind of hyped myself up today. I thought, oh, today's my last learning day, but turns out next week I have class too. And I discovered this when my teacher said, see you guys next week. And I'm like, oh, you still have to show up. Not that I feel bad about it. Like I'm pretty excited. Okay, so this is, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna be using this sauce. I'm just going to mix in olive oil and lemon juice. I like to have really plain salads. Uh, and then I'm going to mix in this like rotisserie chicken from Costco. Happy Tuesday. I'm going to head to school now. I have a class at 2 p.m. And then afterwards, I'm going to go grab some drinks with some friends before our evening event, the last lecture. And it's really just to commemorate all the graduating students in Sauter. So there's gonna be champagne, there's gonna be food, and it's business casual. I'll see you guys in a bit.
to waiting, <laughs> unfortunately. I know. Saw her last night, your baby. What are y'all celebrating? Oh, we're alumni now, man. Snow. Yeah, god damn, dude. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get that alumni discount for UBC yeah. Bookstore. Yeah. It's my pleasure to announce that this year's recipient of the Dorothy Ann Dilworth Memorial Prize is Lydia Yu. Hey! Take the read. Hey guys, we're at Solder Cat Night and, or not Solder Cat Night, Solder Last Lecture and Cat is drunk. Okay, no. She's, she, but look at the champagne glasses though. <laughs> She's drunk, trust me. Good lighting. So, all right. So we just finished the last class of solder. We're on the way to the parkade. A nice little social, nice little finger food. It's pretty bad food, not gonna lie. Okay, I was expecting some wraps, oh right? God. But then they gave us like single shrimps. Yeah, and the shrimp. food was like maybe like one gram per bite. It was the smallest bites you can imagine. Oh I had God. four cups of ice cream because that was I was good. so that was, hungry. That was, that was but it was rain or shine, so it was good. But Couple yeah, champagnes. Yeah. Thank you, Josh. Right. Um, and then it goes to $14.19. Good morning. I just got off the phone with a partnership coordinator for a brand. And this is actually really, really interesting because it's not like a one-time type of relationship where they send product and I just make one post. Like we're actually trying to commit to a long-term partnership. So I'm, I'm pretty stoked because they have really cool products. In a few minutes, I'm about to hop in another business call for a clothing brand that a friend started. So it just feels kind of super serious. Hi. Hello, how's it going? Good, how are you? Good. Good morning, you guys. It is April 7th, and today is my last day of class. A lot of people have classes still on Fridays, but I don't have it. So today is my official last day of undergrad. It still has not sunk in yet. I don't know, just, I think it'll hit me at around like 3 p.m. when I'm in my last class. I know Jeff's gonna give like a, a whole spiel, like, oh, you made it this far, blah, 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 blah. And then it's gonna hit me and then I'll be kind of like sad. But honestly, when I first started university, I never really thought about this day because undergrad just felt like it was gonna be a long journey. And maybe at some moments it did feel long. Overall, I think undergrad just felt like a whirlwind like it went by so quickly made so many amazing memories met so many people along the way and lots of lessons learned and so i'm just going into my last day today feeling very grateful a bit sentimental it was new overall just really excited it's gonna be a fun day last two accounting classes they're handing out free popcorn in the cpa hall and then i'm gonna meet up with the rest of my class at the cambi bar in the evening tonight so lots of things ahead but you know gotta pace myself because there is one more event tomorrow it's ldoc so for most of the students Tomorrow's the last day of class, and they have music artists that are coming. Loud Luxury, Manila Gray. I don't really know them that well. I know like one or two songs. I don't know. I'm like an old soul, so and I'm gonna be tired by like 7 p.m. You don't know it. Come on. No. He's got a million subs. I can know it. So, Huey. I think it's literally Katrina Kwong. It's just my name. So, this is Jerry's care package, but we're going to be sharing it today. I mean, opening it. Actually, you go, for it, go for it. I actually took one of the things already. It's the spiced granola. Help. What is this? Crack Crack pepper. pepper crackers. Huh? Kiwi, Kiwi chips. chips. This is all free, by the way. You can see. Do you like this Pepperoni stuff? stick? Pepperoni stick. 
almond crisps. Mmm. Sour hippo gummies. That this actually looks really good. A margarita. Oh, this is actually Sans cool. Alcohol. No alcohol. Put in like a shot in there. It's just pop. <laughs> oh. Strawberry. Oh, this looks so good. Mimosa. Of course. Wise bite. So it's like perpetually sponsored by Red Bull and Yerba Mate. Cookie. A towel. Oh, what? That's so nice. Oh, it's a beach yeah. Look at this. The issue is Oh. Pumpkin seed buttercups. These are fire. It's award winning, actually. Lens, why is it so small? There's like one inside. Anything, any last words for, you know, the young people? Ah, it's been a good five years. Lots really of memories. Nice. Yeah, lots of memories. Great it's been nice to get to know Kat <laughs> since first year from her. Her days. <laughs> <laughs> Do not know how to finish out. Good days. You too, Jay. You know, I witnessed his first hair glow up Thank in Jeevan's yes, yes. bathroom. You witnessed the first haircut, yeah. It is crazy. Everything just happened at Orchard Commons, so yeah. that's a wrap. Introduce your name and we'll find. I'm Ria and everybody thinks I'm Priya. I'm Ellie. <laughs> Hello, don't <Dupri. laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, I'm Noah. How's it going? So today it is Friday, April 8th. Block party's happening. I literally look like I'm dressed to, you know, stay inside, but it's an outdoor event. It's going to be raining. It's not that sunny out right now, so got to stay warm. The event starts at 4, but I don't think my friends and I are going to line up until like I literally cannot believe undergrad is officially over. Seriously, it just does not feel real at all. <laughs> Y'all are so loud. So loud. Yes. <laughs> Get some boba. <laughs> I'm dead. 